I have been bombarded with the requests of best books of 2017, worst books of 2017 and videos like that. But to be able to make those kind of videos, I need to tell you what are the books that I actually read in 2017. Because you must know what is the pile I'm using for selection of the videos that are about to come. So this is precisely about the 2017 reads. All the books that I read in 2017 have been shown in this video. So if you want to know what kind of books I read in 2017, keep watching. Hi guys, I'm Manpreet and I make book related videos on this channel and today's video is about my 2017 reads. Let's get started with it without wasting any time. Before that, some facts about my reading. So I took up the Goodreads reading challenge which was to read 51 books this year. I actually read 55 books so a big thumbs up to me. The shortest book that I read was of 32 pages which was Indian Share Market for Beginners by Vipin Cuts. And the longest book that I read was of 482 pages, again an Indian book, Kalki by Kevin Missal. The most popular book that I read was To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee which according to Goodreads have been read by 4 million people. And the least popular book that I read was The Lynchpin by Neeraj Ashok which has been read by 3 people on Goodreads. It's a kind of nice book. So, no comments right now. Now the highest rated book that Goodreads is showing me in my reading list is actually a big fat joke and a big fat slap on the faces of people who think you know, the ratings really, really are general or anything like that. Because this book is actually a part of my worst books as well. Does it really mean anything if I give the spoiler alert after giving the spoiler? But anyway, that book is The Man With Five Heads by Abhishek Leela Pandey. Now, I'm going to show you all the books that I read in 2017. And I'm not going to dive into the description or anything because most of these books which need a notable or some kind of attention would be covered up in the coming videos. So make sure you subscribe right now if you want to catch all those videos. Your notifications should be on so that you do not miss any of the yearly wrap up videos which are awesome. There is best books of 2017, best Indian books of 2017, worst books of 2017, best non-fictions of 2017. All of these videos are going to be awesome. So if you want some recommendations, notifications on Let It Snow by John Green, Maureen Johnson and Lauren Myrickle. A Caribbean Mystery by Agatha Christie. Bloodlines by Rochelle Mead. The Witch of Portobello by Paulo Paulo. The Undomestic Goddess by Sophie Kinsella. The White Tiger by Arvind Adija. Black Suits You by Navaneel Chakrabarti. Molding My Destiny by Patrice M. Foster. The Notebook by Nicholas Parks. Everyone Has a Story by Savi Sharma. Percy Jackson and the Titan's Curse by Rick Riordan. The Four Patriots by Sumit Agarwal. This Is Not Your Story by Savi Sharma. Jim Morgan and Seven Sins by Bharat Madan. 13 Steps to Bloody Good Wealth by Ashwin Sanghi and Sunil Dalal. The Art of Selling by Zig Ziglar. Rise of Shivagami by Anand Neela Kantan. First book by Kiruba Shankar, The Great Indian Obsession by Aditya Ayer, Wasted in Engineering by Prabhu Swaminathan, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll, Kursana by Charles Wellington, Lynchpin by Neeraj Ashok, Once Upon a Genie by Durya Kapasi, The Woman in Cabin 10 by Ruth Ware, Percy Jackson and the Battle of Labyrinth by Rick Riordan, The Girl on the Train by Paula Hawkins, Bark by Anuja Chauhan, Sign of Ikshwaku by Amish Tripathi. Don't Believe in God Till You Experience Him by Mukul Kumar. Warriors of Dharma by Chandranshu Chaudhary. And The Man with Five Heads by Abhishek Leela Pandey. I did have the paperbacks of both of the books but I gave them away in my unhaul video and I'm glad you guys have already received them. Two of those books. Palace of Illusion by Chitra C. Banerjee. Clockwork Angel by Cassandra Clare. How to Be a Bows by Lily Singh, Sita Warrior of Mithila by Amish Tripathi, City of Fallen Angels by Cassandra Clare, To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee, What Was My Fault by Aziz, The Murder of Roger Ackroyd by Agatha Christie, After the Funeral by Agatha Christie, Rich People Problems by Kevin Kwan, The Murder on the Links by Agatha Christie, 
Rich Dad Poor Dad. I read an e-book. That's why I do not have the book with me. Kalki by Kevin Missel. Golden Prey by John Sanford. Perks of Being a Wallflower by Stephen Shibotsky. Vertical Living by Vidyangi. Indian Share Market for Beginners by Vipin Karts. Again, I read it on my Kindle. The Monsoon Murders by Karan Parmanandka. Turtles All the Way Down by John Green. Unlawful Justice by Vish Dhamija. Mother on the Orient Express by Agatha Christie. Men and the Dreams in the Dholadar by Koshri C. Shivu. The Boy Who Loved by Durjoy Datta. Transit Lounge by Sunil Mishra. An Unsuitable Boy by Karan Johar and Poonam Saxena. The Boy with a Broken Heart by Durjoy Datta. And I think I'm done with the 55 books. If I missed any, I'll put the names below right now. If you don't see any names, make sure you hit a thumbs up because I'm so awesome. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching this quick short video. I hope it's short. <laughs> about the books I read in 2017. And I am hoping that you guys will also tell me about the books you read in 2017. Tag me in your Instagram pictures. Or if you are a YouTuber, make a video about it and let me know. That's it for today's video guys. Thank you so much for watching. I have a lot of yearly wrap up videos with a lot of recommendations lined up. So make sure your notifications are on. I'm repeating it again. Don't miss them. Thank you so much for watching this video. This might be signing off. I'll be back with another video very soon.